handoff. Fine, keeps it himself. He's gonna walk into the end zone. Touchdown, Leopards. Pierce with a man in motion. It's gonna be a fake pitch. Now it's an end around. There's some open room on that side He's of the field. It. Throw it down the field. There's a receiver there. Look at this. Touchdown, Frazier. Top play of the week. Oh my goodness. Whoa. That could be. What a play with no time on the clock. Orndorff gonna throw. Has a man. It's intercepted by Vecchio again. That's the third of the game. He has a lane onto the outside. He's at the 20. He's at the 30. 40. Orndorff is there. He's on the sideline. He's gonna take it all the way. This will be the longest play, unofficially, officially, based on our records, in CUTV High School Football Game of the Week history. Harris, over the middle. It's complete to Smory. He's gonna run into the end zone as they're breaking some tackles. What a play. Luke Smory. Can I have some more? Harris, low snap, play action. He looks, he fires for Gary Brown. Touchdown! California, Gary Brown, his second touchdown of the game on fourth down, and California having some fun in the rain today, dancing in the rain. Pistol here for California, play action here for Harris. He's looking for Gary Brown. Brown's gonna make the catch, spins away into the end zone, touchdown Falcons. Gary Brown making it happen again. <music> Jessica Toby over to Fozy. Skirpa sets up Barrett, blocked off of Wheeling Jesuit Cardinals, Point California. Lodaborski sends it over, floater, and just falls in. California wins the match on an ace serve off the net. California wins the faceoff. Still 137 on the five minute major shot, and that goes in for California. That's cold beer. as well as now there's a clear breakaway here that's number eight Kyle Cunningham at the front of the net shoots scores and we're all tied up at one with 10.33 left in the second period
uh, women's basketball again, you know, kind of capitalizing off the uh, championship last season, uh, going to South Dakota, you know, and kind of expecting you know, how can it get any better than that. And I had the esteemed pleasure of announcing with the PSAC Director of Communications, Nick Moeller, uh, just an amazing experience to be able to announce with him, do play-by-play, -play, uh, get his insight as well. And of course, the Vulcans winning makes it uh, a win-win situation. The first game that I went to with you guys was probably my favorite one. I mean, it was just still getting to know everybody, but, but you know, the best experience. Because I finally knew that this is what I wanted to do. The Halloween shoot this year was actually pretty fun going up to Gannon and we had the football game. Uh, getting to announce off the top of that, uh, I don't know if it was a concession stand or a shed or whatever it was, but uh, that was something enjoyable, really cool angle and uh, first time announcing with Danny Beck. Well, I like, I like going up to Erie, believe it or not. Um, I think that that is my favorite thing, uh, whether it's uh, going up and when we went to Gannon, uh, that was the first time I went to, to Erie, uh, that was a football game. And uh, that was awesome. I love just going up and, and being with everybody for long periods of time, just seeing how everybody works together and all that stuff. I think that's cool. All the road trips. So I wouldn't say one in particular moment, but one season would probably be football that I really enjoyed. The washout that was homecoming last year. Um, my parents ended up buying me new shoes out of it. It was a good day. Going to and from the games, driving in the car, listening to the music uh, is usually me. Steve and Cheyenne and Danny in the back just jamming out together and making up dance routines and everything. It was always fun. In the van, there's Steve. He's our choreographer, so he's definitely number one. Um, then number two is probably Mike, because he, uh, he can feel a beat. Uh, three, I'm going to put myself. Four, Ryan. Sometimes he does his little like thing in his chair where he goes like this. And then five, probably Sarah. Six, Zach, because he shouldn't be dancing, he's driving. 